I can't be serious. This can't be happening to me. <sighs> this can't be happening. I mean, I, I studied so hard. <sighs> the actual SATs are just in a few weeks. I can't take them with scores like this. <sighs> what is all the commotion? Are you okay? You look upset. Mom, don't be disappointed, but uh, I did pretty bad on the practice SATs. What do you mean? You studied really hard. What was your score? 740. What? This is unacceptable. You have to do better. I, I know, Mom. I, I didn't do it on purpose. I, I was really trying. Uh, we can't have a score this low. We just can't have a score this low. I'm gonna get a tutor. No, 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 no tutors. You have to get higher scores than this. You cannot get into colleges with this low of a score. I know, Mom, but I've already told you, okay? I don't want a tutor. I'll study by myself. I can do it. I know I can. Well, clearly you can't. Listen, your sister had a really good tutor that got her scores up and she got into UCLA. I'm gonna call them right now. No, I, whatever. Forget it. Trevor, it's nice to meet you. Your mom says that you've been having some troubles with the PSAT. Well, I'm here to help. We'll get your score up in no time. Yeah, wow. Where'd you even come from? Hey, mom, how'd you call a tutor so quick? It's all right. She's gonna help you, I promise. But that was quick. <laughs> well, I'm gonna leave you two to get to it. I'm picking up pizza for dinner. Remember, get those grades up. This isn't a joke. Well, let's get started. Yeah, sure. Okay. So Trevor, can I see your PSAT exam? Seeing your questions and answers will really help me understand what we need to focus on. It's, uh... Right here. Whoa, Trevor, this is bad. I know, it's not great. But I... Not great, this is terrible, awful, horrendous. I mean, no offense, but you're kind of stupid. I tried my best. <laughs> Clearly your best isn't good enough. A baby could do a better job than this. Let's get to studying. We're gonna have to start right at the beginning, back to the basics. It's gonna take a century to get you caught up. <sighs> Can we please take a break? No. Stupid people don't get breaks. Absolutely not. <laughs> Quit complaining. Do you want to be an idiot forever? You're my tutor. You're supposed to help me and encourage me. What is wrong with you? What's wrong with me? I'm not the one who's a bona fide idiot. Here I am thinking that we can just try things and go over things and you get better and you get better, but no, no, that's not what's happening here. Now answer this next problem or I'm gonna take your paper and light it on fire and you can do 20 more. Okay, okay. Actually, I think I did it right. Well, let's see. No, Trevor, what is wrong with you? Oh my gosh. Like even a friggin' water buffalo could get this by this point. I just keep going over and over and over again. You'd think you'd take it seriously. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. You're a moron. What are you doing? I said I was gonna put it on fire. What is this? Who does this? Oh, jeez. What happened to you? You look dead. 
Hello? Oh, tutor. Tutor? Yeah. I didn't do so hot on my PSATs, so my mom's making me study with this tutor who helped out my sister. Oh, man, that bad, huh? Yeah. Dude, she's a nightmare. I mean, she made me study for six hours straight with no breaks. And the whole time she was just yelling at me. I mean, it was basically bullying. What? Six hours? Yep. And now she's coming over again tomorrow. Goodbye, my social life. And she's scary. Bro, I think this is something you should probably be telling your mom. I mean, your tutor shouldn't be scaring you. Yeah, it's very true. I do not want to see her again. Yeah, well, I'm sorry, bro. I mean, I would invite you to play some ball, but it seems like you probably can't go. <laughs> yeah, because of my wicked tutor and my crazy mom. Yup. Well, good luck. I'll catch you later. Thanks, man. Now I have to try to not fall asleep in class. <laughs> Mom, can we please cancel today's study session? I am so tired. Hi, idiots. Education never takes a day off, so neither will you. Especially with how yesterday went, I saw no improvement. Let's go! You're late! Let's get started! <sighs> What's wrong with you? What do you mean? You have bags under your eyes and you look a wreck. Is something wrong with you? No. Nothing's wrong with me. I'm just really tired. Tired? <laughs> We've barely even done anything and you're already this much of a mess. Not only are you stupid, but you're weak. We've barely even done anything. You made me study for six hours straight yesterday. I mean, my brain is practically mush. And you'll have to study for a lot longer if you want to see any improvements. It's like I'm trying to teach a sloth to do rocket science. Why are you being so rude to me? I mean, I'm trying my best. Well, I thought you would be as smart as your sister, but I guess that's my mistake. Okay. Are you even related to her? I'm done with all this. What's going on, sweetie? Hi, ma'am. We were just going over some math formulas when Trevor lashed out and started yelling at me about how I wasn't a good enough teacher. Trevor? Uh, mom, it's... That is not okay. Apologize. Oh, Mom, it, it's not true. Listen, you cannot talk to people like that. Just because you didn't want a tutor doesn't mean you get to be rude. Apologize. Oh, Mom, it's not true. Apologize. Now. I'm sorry, Lisa. That's all right, Trevor, but you do understand you'll have to do extra math problems now? Yeah. You cannot talk to people like that. Just because you didn't want a math tutor does not mean that you get to be rude. We're going to have a talk about this later. Yeah. Now focus. I'll be in my room. Okay. I hope no one hurts me, pull up. I can't wait to surprise them. You've been on that same page for 10 minutes. How are you supposed to get started? It takes you seven minutes. I know. Sophie? Sophie! Hey, buddy. What are you doing here? I would think that would be obvious. I'm tutoring your brother. No, you're not. You're done. Get out of here now. Excuse me? You heard me. What is going on? Sophie, sweetheart, you're here. Mom. Oh, darling. <laughs> it's so good to have you here. <laughs> it's so good to see you. <laughs> but why are you here? Well, I missed home and I wanted to surprise my family. Oh. <laughs> but, Mom, why is Lisa here? Why did you hire her again? 
I hired her to tutor your brother because she did such a good job with you. He did not do well on the PSAT. Mom, no, no, she can't. She is a horrible tutor. Don't be rude. She's right here. Mom, look at Trevor. He's exhausted. It's obvious that she's doing the same thing to him that she did to me. Look, I didn't tell you all of this back then, but she is rude and patronizing. She insulted me the entire time she was my tutor. She lies, manipulates, she overworks you, and I cannot stress this enough, Mom, Mom. She is so rude. We cannot let her torment Trevor anymore. No, what? Seriously? She did the same thing to you? I mean, I thought I was the only one. Hello! <laughs> Right here. This is absolutely preposterous. Is this true? Yes, Mom. It's what I've been trying to tell you the whole time. I mean, she even set my homework on fire. That is absolutely not true. I mean, your children are just total brats and are too idiotic to understand my material. I mean, if you hadn't raised such two idiots in this- Wait, 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 wait. What did you just say to me? The truth. Excuse me? Get out. Get out now. This is a waste of my time entirely. Get out. They don't get their smarts Nobody from you. Nobody talks to my kids like that. And you're not getting your last paycheck. <sighs> Trevor, I am so, so, so sorry. I wasn't listening. What else happened? Well, she was really rude. Um, she always yelled at me, made me feel stupid. Mom, I know you want me to score higher, and I don't want to disappoint you, but I'm trying. Oh, buddy, I am so sorry. All I did was add pressure to you. You know what? I saw you were working so hard. I'm so proud of you. You know what? It's just a test. You get what you get. It's not gonna define you for the rest of your life. And you are so smart. And you're gonna do amazing things regardless of any SAT score. And I can hardly wait to see. You know what? I'm gonna help you with, with studying, okay? No more crazy tutors. <laughs> oh, Sophie, if you went through that too, why didn't you tell me? Mom, it wasn't a big deal. I handled it on my own. I just, I stopped going to sessions with her and studied on my own. I just, I knew how important you thought having a tutor was and I didn't want to disappoint you. Oh, honey, that had to have an effect on you. And your mental health and happiness is way more important to me than your test grades. I don't want anything like this to happen to you guys again, so please come talk to me. And if I don't listen, make me listen, okay? <laughs> you have permission. Oh, I am so sorry. I think I'm gonna give a very nice complaint call to the tutor service so that maybe we get her fired. And this doesn't <laughs> happen to anybody else again. <laughs> Come on. I love you guys. I love you too, I love mom. you.